Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. Depending on where you are in this world, this is Hedgen Lee, and I'll let you share with you a trend that seems to be accelerating. More and more altcoins are hitting new bear market bottoms. Here is a chart of XRP. It has done a phenomenal classic one, two, three, four, and five impulse sequence. And this was really the gist of the 2017 rally, the bull rally in this case. And of course, after five waves, there must be a requisite correction. It is unavoidable. It must happen. The 5-3 ratio is a Fibonacci ratio, which is why Elliott Waves is governed by Fibonacci. And that correction many thought was over here as A, B, C, and all done, and blue skies. I don't think that's the case. I think this initial down was the subwave composition of the A wave itself. Then we have the B. You can see this is a very three wave construct. Look how three wavish it looks. When it's three wavish, it's very corrective. So if we have an A, B, C is probably not done here. Could it be done? Yes. It could be done here. Well, we again, have blue skies. But let's look at the pattern. We have a left shoulder, head, right shoulder. Heck, even the gut, the volume confirms. So for XRP, a new bear market was made on August 12th or so. And I think newer lows in this bear market is likely given this bearish pattern, the head and shoulders topping. Now, let's look at Bitcoin Cash. How different is it? Not too different. We have one, two, three, four, and five. Then the requisite correction. Many th thought this was the correction. Well, this ABC is probably not the correction. Number one, altcoins do not know how to correct quickly. And if everyone thinks this is the correction, it's too quick. I mean, for the correction to occur in less time than the impulse itself would be quite unusual. It would be at least half the time, or if not equal to the impulse, if not longer in time than what the impulse took place within. But let's look at the pattern. We have the left shoulder, the head, the right shoulder. Yes, there's a very nice bounce happening because this is a very nice support. And this line is called a neckline. Thereby, it's called the head and shoulders topping pattern. This decline was likely in five waves. One, two, three, four, and five. Then we have, look how overlapping this is. This is not a trend reversal impulse. This is a corrective rebound. So this is what I'm, is what I'm calling the WXYXZ for the B wave. Given this head and shoulder stopping pattern, I think the bear low is likely to be somewhere in the 160s, 50s, and maybe even as low as the 120s. So given this pattern, the pattern is complete. Every part is complete, except it does not yet have confirmation. That confirmation is if the price goes below the neckline, just like what XRP did. And if it does go below the neckline and stays below it, that is what you call the confirmation. And I believe that will happen likely to be very soon. What does that mean? Bitcoin Cash is in a very precarious position with regards to this pattern. And LA wave demands that the requisite correction first be completed before a trend reversal occurs. So that trend, the current trend of greater number of all coins hitting new lower bear market bottoms 
signifies that for many of the olds, the bear market is likely not yet over. I hope you find this to be helpful. At Hedging.com, we trade, we invest by analysis of this type. We ask as many what-if scenarios to be able to identify opportunities for not only trades, BTFDs, buying the freaking dips of corrections. If you find this in, interesting, please do consider joining Hedging.com as a member. Have a great day.